I worked at a pizza place, but it was always just like, my main focus was music, you know? Ever since I was little, I'd, I was always like, yeah, I wanna grow up and do this, you know? I wanna go tour around. I had a little guitar book that showed the fingerings of chords, like tabbing out chords. And that's all I wanted to do, write or play guitar. They were smart enough they could have gone to college, but they knew that they wanted to uh, be in a band and they wanted to tour. Hey, how y'all doing? We're two Calvary Lives from Corners, Ohio. Music was always there. I mean, it was there literally from the day he was born. He always wanted to play guitar, and then he just started to teach himself. One day he showed up with a set of drums of Micah's, and they set up in the dining room, and he played Wipeout. It's going to be like our first actual taste of like a real studio. I'm pretty excited about that. They're naturally a really good band, and it, I think it would be unfair to them to go in and, you know, and just sort of impress your vision or something upon them. I think it's pretty obvious to both of us that the band should be represented in a pretty accurate way. The best of what they already are and magnify that. We would love for this record to take us to the next level. Maybe not to sleep in the van as much or, you know, or at all maybe. I'm really confident that it will be a stepping stone for us. To what? Who knows? If you can't do it live, then there's no sense in even making a record. The point is to go out and play your music in front of people. We have had our share of, our fair share of, of playing somewhere in front of nobody. Some nights are good, some nights are tonight. It's not us, it's shit need. We're a band that when we have downtime, we're gonna have cash flow problems. I park cars. During the week, I stock up the football stadium. If somebody asks me what I do, I don't go, hey, I supervise concession stands at the horseshoe. Say I'm a musician.